what is good aquarius welcome back to my channel thank you so much for being here with me we are going to do your weekly reading so scorpio i have three cards here for you we have the karma card the magic card and it says alignment under it and then we have the oshun card which is justice so your favorite color might be yellow or, or you like wearing yellow here but what i'm getting is there's something here that you're feeling like you're behind on something or you're wondering is what you're doing working or are you receiving justice for something so you could be going after something or you could be have a legal situation that you're waiting for to to make a turn but I'm seeing here something with the alignment card like you want to you're 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 wondering are you truly in alignment with what you want because maybe things are kind of turning the opposite way right here so I'm hearing something about like you're unsure are you getting negative karma or are you moving forward in your life here so let's take a look at that because I feel like there's something that is actually working out for you but it looks like it's not here so let's see what that is all right Let's see, what's going on for my Aquariuses this week? I'm hearing to release expectations, Aquarius, because I feel like here with the Four of Swords in reverse and the Ten of Pentacles, I feel like you're still holding on to something that is no longer serving you, which keeps that karmic energy flowing through you. And so you're unable to see your ten of pentacles you're unable to see the things that are already there for you and so with the moon card here your magic seems to be like hidden from you or your true power your alignment seems to be hidden from you because with the hangman here you may have some illusions going on or like some old but limiting beliefs that are keeping you from seeing who you truly are so i feel like with the ten of swords in reverse you're still not able to let something go and you it also may be due to the fact that you still have old people around you that may be you have grown apart from and so these are people that maybe you have grown through a lot of times with had a lot of things happen with like a lot of life milestones with and you may be like don't want to let those people go but it's something about like the world is trying to open up to you but it's like you're kind of closing yourself off yeah with the seven of swords in reverse queen of pentacles in reverse and five of wands here so there's a lot of conflict going on in your life right now but it's because you're worried about like moving on or leaving people behind but it's like it's holding up your finances or holding up the way that you see yourself because i'm getting something here about like you're seeing yourself through an old lens and it's causing you to be not at peace with whatever you have going on in your life even if amazing things are happening to you Aquarius you wouldn't even see them because you're like battling all this old stuff that you're trying to drag into where you're going now so let's see what this is because I feel like you're still in an old timeline and you need to get rid of these limiting beliefs because like yeah the ten of pentacles is already here for you it's like you're not trusting in your ideas or trusting in what it is that you want and you're still not letting go of a certain perception of yourself that you see yourself in let me clarify that yeah something about you can't do it or you can't move forward or you can't you're, you're always going to be here or there's something about that listen Aquarius like listen if you can see what I see here like things are working out for you the only reason they don't look like they're working out for you is because you're rejecting them you're not moving forward you're not really taking that time to really thrust yourself forward here and it's all about you letting go of limiting beliefs here about yourself and possibly seeing yourself through the eyes of old people so you still may be hanging out with people that you're no longer even resonating with so with the ace of pentacles like it's hard for your new start to begin to like root down and like you start to see the abundance coming from whatever it is you're doing you can't even see the new beginning here with the full card because you're still looking from an old lens okay so let's see <laughs> this sounds familiar <laughs> knight of cups the six of wands in reverse and the six of pentacles yeah so you're still treating yourself with knight and page energy so you only see yourself as a fraction of who you truly are and with six of wands you don't even really see yourself as capable of standing out at this point and you feel like you're working hard for something and it's not coming in you're working hard and all that abundance is back there all that food all the blessings all the money that you want but you're you can't even see it it's not being unveiled to you and the world 
tarot card at the bottom come on Aquarius things are already looking up for you but you gotta like it's something about you need to clean your glasses or something like that I'm hearing like something about like you're just you're really like allowing yourself to stay in an old place what is this that was yeah ace of wands it's ace of swords yeah you keep on looking at the same thing that you can't even see that you know you have new downloads for things that are that want to come into you that want to be in your life that want to attach themselves to you but you're like no i'm over it and i don't know why because you're trying to change what's happening from an old point of view when you go inward and this is what you need to do this week when you go inward and really focus focus on yourself Focus on what you truly want and change the perception of yourself is what I'm getting. You will see that you've had it all along. You know how to play chess. You know how to like maneuver through life to get what you want. And you will see that you had that all along with the, the Emperor card and the Queen of Swords. So you'll be back towards yourself. I saw the Three of Swords card wanted to pop up. But you'll see that you'll get back towards yourself when you do this. Yeah, when you get stable within yourself, Aquarius. So let me get one more spirit. Stability comes from within first and then it's pushed out, okay? So that is what you need to know. The more you get stable with yourself, and you could be seeing owls lately. I saw one this morning and I'm like, am I supposed to see an owl like during the day? But yeah, I seen an owl this morning. So you could be seeing owls. And then we got the king of wands in reverse. So let go of like the ego and the need to like be right and try to fix things from an old perspective, Aquarius. You're a totally new person. And the moment you realize that, that's when things will start to change and you will see that the magic and the alignment was already there waiting for you just to hop on. All right. So Aquarius, thank you so much for watching this reading. Thank you for being here. I hope that you do have an amazing week. All right. So I would love for you to join the family. So make sure you should subscribe and like and all that good stuff. And I've been getting emails about, um, reading phone calls. So I do have those available now if you want to book a private session with me through phone. And also the digital um, readings are still there as well. So everything will be down in my description box below. And I will see you guys on my next reading. Bye.